79. Real, 79 Z28. Real Z28. Is it a four-speed? That's automatic. But it is a rust-free car, guys. Well, I take that back. It's see right here on the front well, end. It's got a little bubble. If that's what you worried about, I see that. That's nothing. Uh -huh. Real T-top car. It's got them ET wheels on it. What, uh, is it for sale? No. Okay. They're starting, like I was saying earlier, they're really coming up. I did not know they had them. Is that an aftermarket thing? Because yep. I thought them was, no. I don't know why I thought uh, them was. But see, this car has got the flares on all four. Uh-huh. It's got it in front and behind yeah, the Yeah, some of them didn't have, them. didn't have them. In the uh, front. Uh, in the front. Didn't have them there. Didn't have them there. See, there's a, uh, they got them in front and behind the rear wheels. Yeah. Uh, in front and behind the wheels. That's a good looking car lower. Oh, wow. And seats are just. Well, that's a good old car. I, I haven't run it for years now. But I've had that car for. It was fairly new whenever I got it. It came really? out. It came out of uh, uh, South Carolina. South Carolina. That's where I bought that at. That's a nice car. Sorry. It's a nice car. We got us some tangs. Are these uh? Porch cars. Porch cars. Guess I walked down through this way again. 65s or 6s or 65s. Now the quarter don't look too bad on this one. On this side. Oh, I see where it's been fixed on the bottom there, but I like to I like to get them in all states. I've I've get them where they're just like shell a bare shell. So you are you the one that used the parts off of it or uh, did you some of the parts? So it was a parts car when you got it. Yeah. Pretty. It looks like it could be the fact that I see the blue on it. Well, the hood could have been changed because the rest yeah. of it don't have the blue. That's what I said. It looks. I thought that looked factory. Now here we got us a factory white one. I guess it was at one time. Well, cream color. Cream color. Uh -huh. It's a parts car. Yeah. Let's say it don't. No, it, but it was, it's, a, it's a complete car there, basically. I ain't going to try to look at that. I think them doors are... Yeah, I ain't going to mess with it. It's kind of stuck. Uh -huh. I just like to get videos. Oh, I like to document them all, man. And there's a lot of parts here. Yeah. And, and you sell parts off these? Yeah. Okay. We got us a little square body S10. They're getting popper. Well, that there one there was bought to make a, a V8 truck out of it. Uh -huh. And then... Uh, Ended up, boy found another one and uh, built it into V8. And this thing here, it still has the rivet factory paint on the bumper or on the frame. It's still nice. Wow, that, that's an ex uh, excellent. So it, it could be built up again, huh? Got us another Camaro. This is Trans Am here. Oh, is it? Yeah. I did. Okay, I should have knew that in the front. I see he did some air for. Must try to keep it cool or something. That ain't factory, is it? Them holes. I don't know. I don't think I'm practicing. I don't think it is, Ben. Uh -huh. You're missing it. That's why I thought it might have been doing it to keep it from overheating. But one down here I thought was cool. He's had for a long time. I noticed it when I pulled in. At one time, guys, he had two engines in this. Two V8s, two 350s. And what year is this, Willie? Steve? It's a 1950. 1950. And I noticed it because I like the. Uh, I like the steel wheels I thought it had when it came in there. I see it don't now. I, I caught that just the end of the steel. And I love the, I thought that was mirror tint when I came in. Here it's metal, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was a mirror tint from the road. Now what's it got in it? And you changed it back. It don't have the two engines in no, it anymore. It's just a thing. I have no motor in it right now. Okay. I made a fuel front end for it. Oh, but this one, did I hear you right? It's for sale? Yeah. Do you want to put a price on it? 4000 Four thousand dollars, good title. Yep. What yep. kind of frames it on? Uh, it's an S10. Okay. Now, did you you had it running after you changed the frame and everything, right? You drove it around into not, not on this one. Not uh, on this, this frame one. here. Uh, we had to notch this here for the fuel pump to set in right here. Uh huh. So you you more or less got you you mocked it up and everything. Yeah, uh, what I, meant to say. I had the motor down in it. But I like that tilt front end yeah. on it. I, uh -huh. I've not seen a a Jeep with the tilt front end on it. 
Oh yeah, Keeps console floors. So it's a solid body. Yeah. You got yeah, oh what right you got it. that seat something out of a newer. What is that out of? Uh, uh, GMC. I see it says GMC steering column. Okay, four thousand dollars. I put a sign in there. I got to put a well. Yes, yeah, I, I see that. <laughs> Reminding you, that's good. You do that. I tell you what, that's a nice little builder right there. This truck right here looks pretty solid. I mean, the rest on the back, they sell them little patch panels. Um, that old truck here, I've, uh, um, last trip that truck was uh, made was uh, coming back from Florida. I'm looking for an old truck. That one there, I, I, I used to drive that Florida back all the time. It's got 300 some thousand on it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So, was it, what went wrong with it? You just... I parked it and the fuel pump went bad on it. I've been going to put a fuel pump on just never did. Is it a seller? Yeah, I'd sell it. Okay. Wet sets, I'd take $800 for it. Um, it's what got, year is it? Uh, 91. Uh, transmission probably ain't got, oh, I don't know, uh, 5,000 miles on it at the most. And it's a V8, right? Yeah, 350. 300,000 miles, but they go, guys. 800 bucks, I'm telling you. And I did, I, I was driving the bank forth to Florida. Yeah, back and forth to Florida, guys. I tell you what, put a fuel pump in, that sounds like an easy fix. It's got the usual rocker rust and everything. Uh, got you another square body four wheel drive down there. Yeah. You don't have, if you don't want to walk, we don't have to do what you want to no, do. Yeah. I mean, no, I, just, I just appreciate it. What, uh, about this one here, is it a seller? I no, know people I'm like, rebuild it. they it's like a, the short beds. Uh, this year truck here, they uh, uh, was ahead of 4.3 V6 in it. It came out of South Carolina. And look at the body on this. Oh There my. is no rust nowhere. Well, you don't even see it that nice. They was running it on natural gas. And uh, they kept turning the gas up the rubber and, mat and the gas down. And uh, they got they got her up too high and burnt the motor up in it. I like that the seat and all. I can't yeah. have too many miles on it, does it? Uh, you know, it's not over hundred thousand. Really? I just thought with that seat. Really. Well, I've never seen them kind of aftermarket headlights. Them. Oh, uh, I put I, that in there. That come out of a Tahoe down there. Okay, they're, I was gonna say I've never seen. They're all aftermarket. I've never That's seen that like. Never seen them like I was gonna say it, it it's there. different. <laughs> I'll give you that. It's different. It's ugly. Yeah. I will. I I'll let you say that. I like the. That's cool that it's short bed. That yeah, I, they're really getting popular. They're totally rust free. What well, about the four wheel drive? Is it for? No, no, it's not keeper? for sale. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll let them go. See them. Up there's a bad diesel up there. A black one. Black one. Yeah, it's bad to the bone. Good, good running. Bad. Oh, you mean like yeah. bad, bad? It's got all kinds of crap done to it. Now, you got some old ones up the hill you said I could walk up uh, there? Yeah, there's uh, You care if I do? No, go ahead. There's Let's just cut this right here, guys. 49. I'll put you on the next video right here. Got us an old motor home and all. Bucket truck. <laughs> yep. Keep being you guys. We'll see you again.